Hey, God bless you too. This is the Rev, the last day prepper, uh, your pre to survivalist. I'm going to do a short video on what about multi purpose uh, travel trailers. Uh, this is our 2007 uh, J Flight unit, and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and share about some of the things that we're able to do uh, with this trailer uh, that we also use as part of our uh, prepping scenario. So, let me show you real quick. Uh, this particular unit has a slide out, it has a uh, two-sided open uh, larger doors that people normally use for you know, to put bikes and to put bigger pieces of equipment so it works out really good for deployment and prepping um, also uh, it has a really nice outdoor feature of a shower which is really good to use for decontamination and for when we partner with a search and rescue with the dogs we're able to go ahead and use that to cool them down um, one of the, the big benefits of these type of units is that they run on a 30 amp connection and as opposed to a house you know that you're hooking up a 200 amp connection uh, you can see where it can have a lot more benefits um, what we've been able to do is just customize it just a little bit to be able to be multi-purpose um, in where we um, kept the bulk of the logistics in it, we did take out most of the furniture. Normally here has a big bed. We took that out, put two small cot beds in it so we could have two people more comfortable. And what we do is as we prep it, uh, pretty much uh, like a bug out unit. Uh, being self-sufficient, having the minimum uh, amount of uh, supplies and stuff to be deployed long term. Uh, we used this unit last last year for 23 days at the hurricanes where we set up a base camp there where we help with the blue tarps for roofing and volunteers. Um, so it, it makes, uh, it, it, it works out really good. We also took out the big cabinets and we updated the stove with only three burners and a little oven. We went and swapped this out out of a unit that was a trailer uh, park model. So just, uh, a, a, you know, a lot more effective. Uh, one of the added benefits about these units compared to having a home uh, and as a prepping capability is that these refrigerations all operate on both electricity and propane gas. So this way you don't have to run a generator constantly. And if you stock it up for deployment, you can go ahead and get everything nice and cold, put the propane on till you get to your, your, uh, to your base camp where you can plug in. Um, big benefits of these units is that they have a complete bathroom in it. Now they're short, they're small and tight, but they, they, they work out really well in where they have holding tanks, which gives you a, a better handle on being able to uh, expose of the gray water, the black water, and it has a nice uh, size holding tank. I'm not sure, maybe 30, 40 gallons of uh, fresh water that you're able to use. The shower works on a small heater that runs on propane and off the 12 volt battery. And the, and the, and the toilet has its own tank. So it's pretty self-sufficient, which is one of the big uh, things about using it as a bug out trailer and using it, you know, for prepping. Uh, this unit in the back had two bunk beds. Uh, these are cool because they just slide off, they slide off. So that this way you can go ahead and fit more supplies if you don't want to use the bed. Uh, the way it was set up before it had a fold down system for additional, for the other beds, part of the bunk beds, but I got rid of them and so this way I could have a lot more supplies and if I do want to add two more beds, I just go with the cots, you know. When I have uh, people over, especially couples, uh, for training, you know, or for the holidays, uh, we also able to go ahead and uh, put the blow up mattresses, so that makes it really comfortable. So it has a lot of, a lot of options. Uh, one of the key things that we were able to do is we took out the big dining set and the couch and we put these uh, easy on and off tables that we can use as our command when we utilize this as a command uh, unit. Uh, we're able to set up laptop computers and we connect our uh, uh, MiFi. And uh, when we use it like we did a couple of months ago when we partnered with local doctor and local nurses, uh, what we did, we did, uh, they did uh, examinations here. Uh, real basic, a lot of counseling. Uh, so it's a multi-purpose, you know, you can use it as a command unit, you can use it, you know, as a medical unit. Uh, a couple outreaches that we do once a year with the homeless is that we'll set up the ends to, uh, to do haircuts and we'll use the shower for them to take uh, nice hot baths. And uh, so as, as creative as you can get. So YouTube, listen, it's something to consider. Uh, it's an excellent prepping capability. Uh, if you have to bug out, if you partner with uh, other people that, that have, uh, um, you know, uh, retreats, 
and you don't have logistics there, this is great, you know, uh, to have. It's comfortable, 13,000 BTAC, a simple 5,000 watt generator can operate it uh, as long as you've got the 30 amp connection. And so it's something to consider as far as being effective with the power inverter already built in. It's an ideal bug out trailer and utilizing it for, you know, your community. So think about you guys that have these trailers sitting all year round, uh, you know, waiting for vacation, how uh, maybe you can help your 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 fellow neighbor. Okay, God bless you too. To the next video.